All right, we're here at 537B. Uh, what is this? Lincoln Village HOA. So, unit is in okay condition. Walk in, you got a tile entry. This is not the original tile, so this has been updated at some point. Um, we also have the laundry right when you walk in. And I believe the ad did say that these are included in the sale. Oh, the water heater is in here as well. It, it is an electric water heater, so it'll affect your bill a little bit different than gas. Let's see. Immediately on the front of the house, you have the kitchen. Kitchen's in decent shape. There's some older tile countertops, but they're in okay condition. A couple small things like some cracks whatnot but totally to be expected with a home this age but the cabinets are actually in good shape and again i don't believe these are original cabinets these have been updated at some point um they actually they they actually look nice um here's our pantry everything's in decent shape the stove is you know older but usable in the microwave and let's just take a look at the inside of the let's take a look at the inside of the microwave that uh, looks okay. All right. Now we have the downstairs half bath. Pretty simple toilet. And again, the cabinet looks like it's been updated at some point. I can't tell what color this is on the walls, but it's consistent throughout the house. And it's in okay shape. Uh, carpet is, is not worn out, but it's definitely old. Um, you know, could use re replacing, but I think uh, we already discussed that. So, got a good sized room here. Um, this would be your dining space here, and you have a little breakfast bar there. This would kind of be your dining area, and then I'm walking backwards here over into the family room or living room, what, what you know, however you would set that up, and then the fireplace is right here. This is a slider to go out to the back patio which you have a little space there which you know you barbecue or have a pet hang out um let's see all right pretty simple let's go upstairs So up here we have all three bedrooms, one on the front of the house. Um, this is a smaller bedroom. I don't have my measuring stick with me, but I'm going to guess it's a, maybe a 9 by 10 or a 10 by 10, kind of standard size. We've got another one here, smaller window into this room. I noticed the other room was a bit brighter, but we do have a window coming into this room. This room is just a hair larger than the last one. Upstairs, we got the HVAC unit. Uh, this appears to be an original unit, um, but no worries there. Again, if you have a home warranty in place, if something goes wrong, it will be repaired. Then upstairs here, we have the full bath same tile on the floor as in the uh, as in the entryway and in the kitchen the toilet tub is a one piece or two piece unit fiberglass or something of that nature appears to be in decent condition and then this would be the last room here oh let me show you the vanity Vanity appears to be original. Well, the top seems to be original, but the cabinet has definitely been replaced, which is odd, but that's what it looks like. I can't tell, you know, I can't be for certain. But, um, and then here's the master bedroom. Definitely a bit larger. Looks like we got a balcony to step out on here, uh, which is nice. So you have a slider, which looks over the street. You have a balcony that overlooks the street. Kind of a nice detail here. Room is actually a decent size, but this is a shared bathroom 
um, upstairs. So you just have one full bath in this guy here. All right. Um, and so there's an entry there from the hallway, which that goes down the hallway. And then you have another entry here from inside the room. So only one full bath, um, one full bath, uh, sorry, one half bath downstairs. All right. So and, uh, no, no multiple showers at a time, but you know, if you can manage, this might work for you. All right.